In this video I will demonstrate an extremely handy circuit to have and that is a battery voltage monitor. It's very simple to make. It uses an LM339IC which is a voltage comparator and it only requires five components and standby current is only 9.5 milliamps. Now if you have a boat and you want to know if the battery is going dead or anything else that's a 12 volt lead acid battery this is exactly what you want to have connected. You can adjust the voltage at which the alarm will trigger. It's a very simple circuit right there. Has a piezo alarm, a potentiometer, integrated circuit, a resistor, and a Zener diode. That's all it takes. Now right now I have a variable power supply right here which is an LM317T which I've been using for ages. Right now I'm simulating the voltage of a fully charged battery in your car which is around 12.65. That's close enough. And it's connected as you can see. And the alarm is not activated. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to gradually lower the voltage down to around 12.15 which is where I have the alarm set to come on. What I'm going to do is adjust this potentiometer to lower the voltage slightly. You can monitor it right here and the, the, the voltage alarm will sound when the voltage drops to 12.15 or right around there. Slow. We're at 123413. Now we're at 1218, 17, 16, 15, 4. Right around 12.1315, it will sound. I'll raise it back up slightly. So it's off at 12.2. 12.19, give it a little touch. 12.14, it should go on any second. And it comes on instantaneous. There you go. 12.1, she's on. So this is great, the circuit. You don't have to worry about a battery going completely dead because now you'll be alerted to the fact that the battery voltage has dropped so you can charge it. Let me raise the voltage back up to shut it back off. There we go. The alarm is now off. So this circuit draws roughly 9.5 milliamps. In one day, 24 hours, it will drain approximately 235, 240 milliamps from your battery, which is nothing. After two full weeks of having this connected to your battery, you, it will have drained approximately two and a half to maybe three amps from the battery which is still nothing because your battery is rated between 50 and 75 amp hours so then you could even go away for a month and come back and it will still work you could make this for other circuits as well this could also be used as a low voltage alarm for a power inverter you could adjust the Zener diode for different ranges of voltage detection so there's a lot of good uses for this circuit. The purpose of this is to let you know in a short period of time, in a matter of days, if a battery goes dead. So when you go to use something, it's not totally dead. And you don't want a battery to be totally dead because when it becomes totally dead for a long time, sulfation will set in and then you could be throwing the battery in the trash. So this circuit will allow you to charge the battery right back up so it will be fully charged if you want to use it.